something that I should have done a long time ago was create a database for a couple of flaws that are difficult to grade for most people because we don't see it often. One of them is three hole punch or have hole punch in a book. The other one would be missing coupons or Marvel value stamps. And then of course, books that have missing chunks as far as you know, big piece of the front covers or the back covers. So going forward, just so that I create a database of these type of books, for sure I will create a playlist for each of the major flaws like three hole punch. So if I run across other books that have three hole punch like this one that are higher grades, then I will make a video just like this one so that, you know, in the future, if anybody asks me, hey, Nick, I have a book that have a three hole punch, what can be the grade? I would say, go watch the videos in this playlist and then hopefully it will help you because I don't really know. But for now, here's the first of the bunch. Okay, so we have a Amazing Fantasy 15, 1.8. It has four holes. 1.8. Okay, so let's zoom in. As you can see, the notes say four binder holes through the book. And from just the location of the holes, you can see that it does not, it won't impact the story inside. Sometimes the holes can be, depending on the location, right? So let's take a look at this book from the far away view. Okay, certainly it's not high grade, it's not even mid-grade i would say it in the area of for now let's zoom in before i say something else all right lots of creases everywhere okay all the edges and corner have problems but nothing huge okay nothing like a big you know six inch corner crease across there are plenty of creases okay but it's not one big flaws beside the four holes all right so let's see about the back cover all right back cover same thing okay it's just a lot of minor flaws a lot of small creases tiny pieces missing at this level this doesn't matter a little tears right here right like a i wouldn't say even half an inch but just a lot of surface wear okay just one of those books that what do you think as far as the grade of this book if there was no holes? I would say without the holes, the grade would be somewhere in the 2 to 2.5. Does anybody disagree? Some people might might give it a 3, but that would be stretching, right? But 2.5 without the holes would be something in the realm of possibility, right? For sure higher than a two but for me looking at this i would say the book has a chance of a 2.5 if the holes was not there so does that mean that the four extra holes there knock the book down two level from a 2.5 ish to a 1.8 possibly but this is just the base case scenario okay i have seen other books with holes in much higher grades you know, there used to be um, a Tale of Suspense 39 that has a whole punch that was higher grade. That was on a CCC forum. So for those that remember that book, let me know. But there used to be one that used to be in the green label. And the person that owned the book cracked it out, resubmitted for a blue label, and it came back surprisingly higher than what I think I thought it could be. But for now, this is the base case scenario. For sure, we can't say that a three-hole punch or four-hole punch will make a book less than a 1.8, okay? Because 1.8 exists right here. So going forward, if anybody see other examples, for sure, contact me and I will make a video and put it in the playlist so that we all can benefit of the knowledge. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.